In the embrace of an age-old forest where time seemed to stand still, there existed a dwelling, a humble abode of a wise old man named Edward. Known far and wide for his remarkable abilities, he held a special rapport with the animals of the forest. His whispers carried the language of the beasts and his heart echoed their songs. Yet, as the forest's tranquility began to shatter, marked by ominous shadows and eerie sounds, Edward felt an impending doom creeping towards his home. Darkness fell one evening, and with it came a monstrous shadow that loomed over Edward's house. Prepared, yet taken aback, Edward shielded his home from the monstrous attack. It was in the aftermath of this confrontation that he realized this was a battle he couldn't fight alone. Thus, he embarked on a journey, a quest for allies against the encroaching evil. His journey was a tapestry woven with encounters of mythical creatures and legendary beings. These allies, drawn to his cause, bolstered his campaign against the impending doom. Together, they braved countless trials and tribulations, their courage and steadfastness guiding them to the origin of this malevolent force. The revelation was a bitter pill to swallow. The source of this great evil was none other than Edward himself. In his youth, his unchecked abilities and fervor had given birth to this menace. Now he stood at the precipice of redemption, the weight of his past mistakes heavy on his shoulders. To vanquish this evil, he had to confront his past and accept his errors. The final battle was a spectacle of courage and atonement. Edward, armed with wisdom and remorse, emerged victorious. The evil dissolved and tranquility restored. His return to the forest was not as a mere old man, but as a hero, a savior who had delivered his world from a terrifying menace. His tale transcended time, transforming into a legend that echoed through the forest and beyond. It was a tale of a journey from darkness to light, of redemption and heroism. Edward, the wise old man, was no longer just a humble dweller of the forest. He was a beacon of hope, a testament to the power of acknowledging one's mistakes and a hero who stood as a guardian of the forest he called home.